divas and what's up divas it's your girl april so this video is going to be of course an affordable lace front wig but before i even start because sometimes i normally don't even get on and say much i wanted to let you guys know that i did pick this up also in a half wig which you can also get from sisterwigs.com the half wig is a little bit more tricky of course you got to take some of your own hair out so i will make sure to post that video as well but yes hawaiian it is and this is by outre the color that i got is in a number two and first of all I was really happy the first thing that I was super happy about is the parting in it was really pretty when I took it actually out of the package y'all I was like what okay come through lace front coming through yes okay so I did tweet some of it but just very minimal 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 I just tweeted a little bit of it okay let's not try to be too fancy and on top of that the wig does come with some combs and these ones are placed in different spots I'm not really sure how these wig companies are doing this now but they really are putting them in kind of like all over the place but anyway there are two in the front one in the back and an adjustable strap now as for the hair texture if you guys are like what is the hair texture am I looking like a little lopsided on the camera am I straight I'm trying to figure this out so yeah so like I was saying I don't even remember what I was saying but oh yes the color the cup the texture so it isn't so silky like really super slippery silky like plastic synthetic -y like silky it is kind of in between silky and yakky to me like they kind of like decided to mix this one up it does have the hard lace so unfortunately ladies you will have to deal with that but it is an affordable wig you can pick this up at sisterwigs.com along with that you can pick up some cosmetics if you're interested also at sisterwigs.com so let me not keep going on and rambling on in this video let's get to it and let's get going and let's put this wig on y'all of course I always do have my handy standy by things which is my elf concealer you can use any type of concealer that you're comfortable with this is what I use I've had this forever okay and I'm also going to be using my pressed powder by pure which is in the color tan yes and my favorite which is topic um hair building fibers so if you have thin edges or are not balding spots or not or you just want the wig to blend in a little bit more with your hairline you can always use topic or also you can also use strand maximizer i do have the links for both of those below if you're interested and yes guys yes combs brush toothbrushes and my favorite hairspray which is aussie so let's get this going
Okay guys, so this is a lot of hair, like a lot of hair for me. Um, I do like a lot of hair, but I think when it becomes synthetic, it just has a different feel, a different appearance because it gets really big and it starts to tangle. So um, when it comes to curly hair for synthetic, and especially if it's like kind of like loose curly like this, I don't like so much of it, like an abundance of it. But it is really nice hair, like super duper cute hair. It's just a, a little bit a lot for me, like a little bit a lot. You know what I'm saying? Like I know that's really not a word or doesn't sound right together, but it is kind of like a little bit a lot for me. Yeah, um, but I do kind of like the curl pattern and I like the texture a lot in it. It's just a little bit a lot for me. So what I would do is I would probably wear it in an updo kind of way. It is making me rather hot, but it's still super duper cute. I think this is more or less like kind of like going out here. But if you want to put it up in a different style, let's see. Okay, so this to me is cute as well because it's kind of like an updo. I don't really have to mess with the hair too much, meaning tease it, brush it out, brush the curls out. I just kind of like gathered the hair and puffed it up right here and then spread it around so that it could look super cute like that. So it kind of looks like kind of like a faux ponytail, but you really don't have to do too much work because it seems like sometimes when I do a lot of work and try to get these half wigs or lace fronts to go up and up do, it's a lot of work. Plus it gets really, really tangly and it's like, you know what? I'm not about to fight the tangles, but if you love like long curly hair, then this one is probably the one for you. I do like the texture a lot. It's just a lot of hair, but the more the hair, the more you can do with it and make it just look more realistic. And all you need to do really is finger comb these curls out because that is like the number one rule. You have to finger comb these curls out. So yeah, it is shedding some on me right here. I'm not really like a huge fan of any shedding, but you know what? It is a synthetic wig. It's not like you spend a lot on it, so it's acceptable. You see guys, I use this to make my edges look a little bit thicker because they were looking a little thin and they are a little thin. That's what happens when you get old, okay? Mmm. But anyway, so yes, check out sisterwigs.com. Let me know what you think of this one, which is Hawaiian by Outre. And I will see you girls and guys on my next video. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs this video up. Remember guys, stay diva and divalicious. I love you and I'll see you around soon.